Hello. Once again, I come back to see my friends. Yes. Hello. Oh, hello. Good to see you. Very nice. good to see you. How Very are you? Nice. Well, we are keeping. Good. We are kicking. Oh, you yeah. look fantastic. Streaming electricity from the sun is something that we all think is possible, but no one's ever done it. And this technology will enable people to connect and communicate in a way that'll improve their lives. The way the story goes is I was in solar module manufacturing. I knew how to build solar panels. It was an invitation to come and help people in Uganda to come up with a cooking device. So I took very powerful solar panels, I linked them together, and I was able to create a current strong enough to boil water by using solar photovoltaics, not solar heat, solar electronics, and boil water and cook. And they thought it was cool, but they asked me if I could charge their phone with, the, with this cooking system. And I said, you need your phones charged? And they said, yeah, if you can charge our phones, then we can communicate and we can prosper. And so I had one person hand me their phone and I plugged it in and the, it lit up and it started charging. And they're like, ha, ah, it's charging, don't unplug it. And I, I said, it's that important to you. And everybody in this uh, group said, it's the most important thing and I said, this is what you need. There's things in the market for this already. I said, there's nothing that lives up to the guarantee. This is a promise that we have to fulfill and focus completely on how do we make these small panels work for this large market request. Everything these days for okay for someone of my age or mostly I can say this generation, it's on the phone. There is no electricity here. It's far where we where they have electricity. When I've got any problem like my baby, she's sick, then I called my husband or I called my sister or anyone. We worked in a garage in Colorado. My garage, two car garage. We didn't know how much power needed to come out of the panel. We didn't know what mobile devices needed. We didn't have control of the energy in the beginning, and it was like a wild ride, like how much energy is coming out of this panel? How much energy is coming out of this panel? We'd plug it into the phone and literally like, you catch it, the phone would burn up. We'd throw it back and it'd be like a hot potato. The thing would be hot, you know, the battery would be melting to, um, you know, plug it in and nothing happens and you, nothing happens, nothing happens. And then we started to get smart and we started to learn on every failure and kept adding up. It was like checking the box, like fast as a wall plug, check. Works underwater, check. Put it in your pocket, check. And on March 6, 2013, I charged a smartphone with my panel. I didn't recognize how powerful that day was in retrospect, but I'll tell you what, I sure felt relief that day. Where is it getting energy from? From the right, from the sun. That is a new language, streaming the sun. And people may look at us as a solar charger because that's all we can think about. We don't have any other frame of reference. We're bringing it to Africa, okay. or the people of Africa who live every day struggling to keep their phones energized. From the zone. All solar chargers have to charge a device to charge a device. So all solar chargers have an internal component that has to be energized before the energy can be used for a device. This technology is a sun streamer. It takes light and converts it into electrical current instantaneously, abundantly. It just takes the sun and turns it right into energy. See, watch when I turn it off. See? And that's what the sun stream is. It takes the sun and streams it directly into the phone without an interruption in between. I 
have our little facility here. This is where we put this technology together. This is the foundation. The innovation is not only the technology. The innovation is how we make it. We've eliminated all the complexities, increased the durability, the lifespan, increased the power, and lowered the cost. Sustainability is, is really about having social and environmental positive impacts. So, you know, we are a triple bottom line company. That's what I've kind of focused on is people, planet, profit. We have three drivers that we measure to the bottom line. How many people do we impact positively? How do we impact the environment positively? And then how do we impact our investors with financial returns? That is an exciting, complex challenge. All we have to do is take a sunstream panel and point it at the sun and we have free, renewable, sustainable energy that's mobile. That's the key to a sustainable future. And I think that that can help mobilize a global army of brand believers that can make a significant impact on what's ahead of us as a society. Good job. Good job. Yeah.